Before we begin, there are some do's and don'ts when it comes to driver swaps in ACC. The best way to avoid any issues related to driver swaps is to follow these points carefully. Ignoring these points may cause your game to crash upon attempting a driver swap. Alternatively, your car may be registered as a new entry and you'll be many laps down. Ignore at your own risk, you have been warned. Driver swaps in ACC are easy, but if you don't know how to do them, this video will give you everything you need to know about driver swaps. First, open your pit stop menu. Then scroll down to the select driver option. Finally, choose the driver you wish to take over the car. You'll see that the driver you have selected now has the status set to requested. All you need to do now is serve your pit stop. It is advisable that you do this before entering the pit lane, as you may not have much time to navigate through your menu if your pit box is close to the pit entry. Driver swaps take 30 seconds to complete. In this time, tyres can be changed and fuel can be added to the car, so keep this in mind when setting up your driver swap. Make sure that the driver taking over the car has clicked drive before the pit stop is finished. Once your controls are unlocked, your driver swap is complete and you are no longer in control of the car. And that's it! You're now ready to compete in any ACC race that has driver swaps available to you. If this guide was helpful, hit that like button and be sure to subscribe to Redline Motorsport for more ACC guides and race content.